vision. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alex and welcome back everybody to the Walking Dead server series. Guys, as you guys can see, I am completely in control of my weapons right now. We are ready to go and fight the server and fight the bandits on here. Now, first of all, guys, uh, there's a bandit over here. Not a bandit, but someone that I guess is a, a friend. And I don't really know, to be honest, so I handcuffed him until I want to make sure everything's safe. Now, I'm going to loot his things out now because I want to make sure... We're going to be safe here, you know. I don't want to be in trouble here and get killed by him. He found me, so I think he's going to be a safe person. Now, I'm just going to keep away all the dangerous uh, type of weapons around here so he cannot kill us. But uh, it looks like he's a friend. Are you a good person? Because, guys, first of all, this is a quite an interesting uh, scenario right now because in The Walking Dead, we are in Seaport in the last episode. And I just want to let you guys know that, first of all, I came back from Seaport to play on here and uh, basically... It's kind of going to go off of a role play, but not really. It's basically me running away from the big city life and going back to Atlanta to control and get some self, like, a, kind of like a base for us to get better and stronger and fight the zombies. And then we might go back to Seaport and stuff like that. So I do have the keys. I'm going to get this guy free and hopefully he won't kill us. Let's hope for the best. And looks like he's kind of going easy here. So, um, let's see if he's going to be kind of easy with us. So... This guy looks like he's, he's not going for us, so I'm going to kind of keep it safe and kind of stay aware of the dangers. Uh, looks like he's getting some food, so uh, hopefully we can go away from him and stay safe. I don't know if he's a friend or not, but if he is, then that's pretty cool. Let's see what he got in here. Small backpack. I'll keep it for him. He can have it. So, guys, if you guys can hit that like button, that would be amazing. Uh, this is uh, the Atlanta server, guys. Atlanta 1 server, if you guys have not known yet. So, that's that. So, you guys have an idea. And I just heard a weapon. Whoa, 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 okay, wait, I, I didn't know, I, sorry, dude, I just want to make sure you're safe, alright, hold up, hold up, here's a bandage, bandage, here's a bandage, bud, come take it, uh, yeah, I just shot him because I didn't know what he was up to, he looked like he was coming for me, so, um, kind of a little bit worried, so here you go, take it, take it, and I'm gonna leave you now, alright, let's get out of here, guys, because I don't really, I, I, I can trust him, but I don't know if he's the best person to be around right now, uh, so we're gonna go walk around. Now, first of all, guys, Atlanta has some other cool little updates around here, which is really cool. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can get out of here safe. And let's see if he comes after us. No, he's not. Looks like he had a gun on him, which is a little bit of a, a little bit of concern. Hopefully he doesn't go after us. Uh, let's take that guy out. There we go. All right, he's safe. Uh, let's move out, guys. Now, first of all, I got a lot better at this. So I heard that there's a lot of people on Atlanta, and all they're doing is just killing people. So I'm on here to stop that from happening, and I'm here to help try and protect this and keep this place safe. Um, again, there's also a little bit of different builds. As you guys can see, we're in a different area. Now, what I'm going to do in this episode, we're going to go and loot out this city. Now, I don't know how safe we are, to be honest, because I don't really know... Who can be in this place? And again, there's all these little secret doors here. So I always want to keep a little bit safe around here and watch my, my marks here because it's a little bit dangerous. And it's pretty kind of cool to be back in Atlanta, to be honest. I kind of missed it. It's been a long time. And this is where I first started off, and I really like Atlanta as well. And I'm also going to be doing the uh, sur survival one, uh, which is the Let's Play, which I will continue as well. We're going to do both of them, actually. I decided to do that, first of all. So if you guys can hit the like button down below, that would be amazing. And I also want to show you guys something. Look at this. We do have a crossbow, uh, but I don't have any ammo for it, which really does suck. I used it all. It just only comes with two bows, so it's kind of a sad thing. But if I do a dash kit, I probably can get it. Dash kit Daryl. Uh, and then that's pretty cool. That's actually a new kit. And yeah, there we go. We actually have ammo for it, which is pretty cool. Fantastic, actually. So if I do reload it, guys, I do have ammo for it. So... That's actually pretty cool. As you guys can see, the bow right across it. This is actually a new update, which is pretty fantastic, I have to say myself. So, uh, there's also these other things I just got from this kit that I don't want to keep with me. Because I don't think it's kind of fair to keep all of it. I really I really don't need it. So, let's drop off what we don't need here. Uh, we don't need much of this. Uh, let's drop off these backpacks. 
and the rest we'll keep that we have with us, like the hatchet. I will use the hatchet instead at the moment, and then we'll put this right back on our back. Hopefully it stays there. Yes, it does. Oh, wait, no, that's, um, I guess that's to reload, so then how do you put it on the back? Let me try to do this again. So, oh, I do have an extra crossbow on the back. Okay, so if we put that there, we should be safe, and we'll be pretty good if we do this. We'll have ammo. Okay, that's awesome. Alright, so as you guys can see, we do have a crossbow like Daryl, and first of all, it's the Walking Dead Marathon today, so it's going to be pretty cool to see that all that happen, and uh, so let's move out of here, guys. we got to kind of keep a search around here, because I have not played on Atlanta for a long time, and I heard it's a little bit dangerous, and it could be um, a bit of a... Oh, there he is. What is he doing? Are you okay, dude? I don't know why he's... <laughs> he's kind of like a lost soldier around here. Lost... A lost soul. Are you good? What is this? I don't want your gun. You can have it. You can take, uh, let's give him some water. No, we need the water, actually. Uh, let's see if we have anything in the backpack. Yeah, we do. We can give him a water canteen and some food, some fresh food. At... Where'd he go? I don't know where he go. He kind of, a uh, he's a weird little fellow. He kind of just appeared here and out of nowhere just ran away. He's gone now forever. It's kind of interesting how he just did that. I don't know. He's in the house now. I don't know. We're gonna go run away now. That guy's a little bit weird. He's kind of just, like, <laughs> I know he's a cool person, probably, but, like, he's kind of just, like, popping out of nowhere so let's get out of here guys now this is one of the big cities and uh, I actually did spawn here which is pretty cool that's why I have all these kits right now I did select all the kits before we started the uh, video today and that's a nightstick so we're gonna go basically well our goal in today's episode is basically to start looting out these places and kind of get a, 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 a feeling of what we have around here because again I don't know who is the boss around the city here nowadays. Uh, it could have changed. That's why I'm back here to kind of keep everything in control and try my best to keep this place safe. And um, and yeah, hopefully it works out well. This is a base part door. Um, so let's go and get out of here, guys. I kind of want to go build a base for the next episode. Not really like an actual base, but go find ourselves a secure place to call home. Because uh, I gotta tell you guys... This place is a little bit dangerous, and that guy is kind of on the roof over there. So I kind of want to keep ourselves safe and away from any dangers, because I don't have ourselves like a clan yet. I'd actually, it's been removed, um, so that's something I have to fix. So we're going to go on this long journey here, this pathway. And hopefully this pathway leads to a safe section, a place that we can call, uh, I guess, a place that we can call safe. Because Atlanta right now is full of a lot more people. Uh, it's 100 people on live daily. And there's a lot of cool new builds. I heard that there's an airport, a mini airport, which we got to go check out next episode probably and see if we can get ourselves something safe around there. Hold off like a little base or something interesting. Now, I don't really like staying around here because I feel like it's dangerous. Ooh, what's this? Looks like that is a... Ooh, that's interesting. Okay, we're going to go check this place. It's like a little lighthouse here. So we're going to go call this, I think, our base for this episode. I think that'll be pretty successful ourselves, but looks like there's a lot of barbed wire. Now, I don't know what to expect around here. I really don't know what to expect, so we're going to have to take this a little bit uh, smooth and always be aware of the dangers around here. Now, this has more ammo. Oh, no, it does not have to reload. That's an, always a big concern of mine. I have to make sure we have everything reloaded and we're good to go. Okay, so it looks like this has been barricaded off. Now, I don't know who is in here. Um, I hope that they are um, open-handed and hopefully they want to allow me in here now i kind of am very tempted to go and check this place out but it looks like there's barbed wire all around here now i am a little bit um concerned about this place now i kind of want to go in here or if not have it secured for us for next episode because this is a place for us to keep i think a base maybe because i think it's kind of it's tall it has a lot of only a one door entry so it kind of keeps us safe from anything and now there's a lot of walkers around here which i'm a little bit nervous about to be honest um so I kind of want to keep ourselves a distance from the walkers. If only I had a barbary kit. Maybe I do, maybe I didn't know about it. Yes, no, can opener. Hmm, okay. So let's take out one of these guys here. And hopefully they don't kill us or anything like that. Because we're kind of pretty much prepared for all the dangers here. Now, they did block off the entrance of this place. There are also some new uh, zombies as well, new walkers. Some new skins to them. So that's kind of interesting as well uh, to hear. So let's see if... Oh, there are people in there. Oh, boy. Okay, we're going to get out of here. Okay. So there are people in there. Uh, I really hope they're not. I just want to say peace. Uh, hopefully they know me. Um, oh, there you go. They do. Wait a minute, guys. This is maybe a chance. Oh, boy. Guys, maybe they can let us in here. This will be kind of interesting. All right. All right. Let me in. I'm going to say let me in. Let me in. Let me in, please. Um, I just need some safety. It's me. It's me. I don't know if that's them. Are they? Th 
It looks like I don't know what's going on now, guys. I'm a little bit nervous. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, they're definitely not friends. Okay, that's not them. All right, let's get the heck out of here, guys. All right, we are in a deep situation here. Um, I don't know what's going on. I am safe at Lighthouse. Please. Um, I, I don't know what's going on now. I'm a little bit endangered here, guys. This is... Uh, let me come. I can help. We allies. Okay. So, those are not the right people I was talking to. Let's get the heck out of here, then. Um, so, looks like there's some people that are actually in a, um, a base over there. So, I don't know. I'm kind of a little bit, uh, it's a concern of mine. So, we're gonna kind of keep our distance and keep that place safe for next episode, guys. We're gonna try to build an army here and try to take that lighthouse down. And hopefully we can, from there, actually build ourselves a strong army on here. A strong, safe group of people. And I have some cool... Uh, things I want to mention first of all guys is first of all there might be a special guest and there might be um, You might see more of him um, through the episodes of the server series guys and I think that's gonna be kind of cool because you guys always ask for that So I might be bringing that back and you guys might enjoy that hopefully and I think that's gonna be kind of interesting now Let's see. Um, I don't want to be I only I had a grenade I could have thrown it in there and they would have been probably dead um, but again, those guys are probably keeping their fort kind of safe over there So I kind of want to go around them and keep away from any dangers uh, so let's let's move around guys. Let's keep this place safe hold out our pistol Maybe no, I just our gun here Maybe we can go travel around and find like a little home That's kind of nearby for us to kind of keep safe. Hopefully that's the that's the goal So it looks like there's a home over there now. This looks like it's a pretty big city uh, Or like a mixed suburban area. I don't know what to call this place uh, But we're gonna go try to find a little home that we can kind of keep safe and see if we can find ourselves a good base to call uh, I guess our fort for now that can actually keep away any dangers of ours here so let's go in here and actually check this place out now i don't want to cause any harm to anyone that's in here so let's actually close all the doors it looks like this place has some good amount of loot so that's pretty good already uh some rusty pipe let's see if we can find any diamond loot yes over here uh oh that's a bounty knife okay that's pretty good and anything here baseball bat so the rest is not too good Ooh, i think i heard someone i'm not so sure no, okay, we're pretty good right now. I'm gonna go in this corner here because I, then I know I'm safe. So let's get some fresh food here and let's eat up a little bit because we are kind of very low on food. And this is a perfect area to kind of keep uh, our base um, for now just to get our feet back on the ground because Atlanta is a whole different world now, guys. It changed from last time I was on here. It's been a while. Nope, that's that's his locker walker. Okay, that's good. We're kind of safe around here. That's why I need a partner, guys, and that's why you guys are going to see someone soon, hopefully, and that'll be pretty fantastic. I wonder if we can take these cobwebs down. Nope, we can't. All right, so that's kind of that. Now, this episode has been pretty intense because I thought those people were uh, a safe people in that uh, lighthouse. So we're kind of, we know where we are. The lighthouse is right about there uh, in that direction. So we're going to go there next episode, guys. We're going to try our best to actually um, kind of take that lighthouse down and see if those people are actually good people. They look like they wanted to kill me, but they didn't look at the same time uh, too friendly. So um, I kind of want to keep away from them for a little bit until I get my feet on the ground, as I mentioned. But yeah, this episode has been pretty successful. We did a lot of cool things. We actually kind of talked about what I'm doing, you know, why this is happening, why I'm back in Atlanta. I'm back in Atlanta for the first reason because it's almost like I ran away from uh, Seaport to get a little bit of some safety, some cover, because the city is a little bit dangerous. So that's kind of why I went back to Atlanta because of the um, buildings here and it's a lot more I guess safe for us to run around a little bit while the city is a little bit more dangerous now I kind of want to stay in this uh, little city area because we can go check out the next place in the next episode, guys. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you guys hit that like button. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy it. It's kind of a, a fresh start again on Atlanta. Uh, basically, we still have our kits and everything like that. Oh, yes, more a crossbow bolt. Okay, that's really good. Ooh, that's fantastic. So now we have ourselves more crossbow. Um, so that's really good. As you guys can see, um, I'll press C and I have it right here. If I hold this down and I shoot, it'll actually do some damage. Now, I wonder if that actually went through. Because it looks like it's not here. That's one of the major issues. Now, I, good thing I have another one uh, for us to have to reload. But um, I don't know what happens with the bows once you shoot them. Sometimes they stay, sometimes they don't. So I don't really know. But if you get... Oh, boy. Okay, guys. This is interesting. Um, there's a few walkers in here. There's actually a few more in the back. So this is going to be a cool, cool ending off the episode for the next episode, guys. It's going to be quite interesting. If you guys enjoyed this episode of The Walking Dead in Atlanta, make sure you guys hit that like button. I'll see you guys next time on more of The Walking Dead. Make sure you guys hit that like button. If you guys are new, hit the subscribe button as well. And I got some future plans for you guys as well uh, that will make The Walking Dead even better, guys. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Alexon, and stay foxy. What's your vision?